Boxing Truth here, back with another video. Make sure to smash that like button, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Wow, man. The theater of unexpected, man. I did not expect that. Liam Smith just ruined a bunch of parlays tonight, including mine. Oh, good, man. That was a interesting fight. Great buildup. I was intrigued. It was a, a real fight between two world-level guys, and it was a competitive fight up until the end. I did not expect a knockout in Liam Smith's favor. i never seen Eubank hurt in a fight. never even seen him buckled. Definitely has displayed an iron chin throughout his whole career, and as, as Smith as well. I mean, he's only been stopped. He's been stopped to the body. I didn't know. I didn't expect the stoppage. If it was gonna be a stoppage, it would be it probably would have been Eubank by cuts or something like. Liam Smith would have been open. He would have been cut up. He would have been bloodied. But uh, he landed some. He landed some big right hands early, and that was the tail of the fight. The right hand was landing as early as the first round. He was landing some. Liam Smith was landing some big ones, and Eubank. The left hand was just too low. Wasn't adjusting to Liam's overhand right every time he would throw the jab. And uh, it cost him big time. The right hand buckled him. And then he was trying to get away after getting hurt pretty significantly. And then he's not looking at his opponent while he's moving away or trying to slip and dodge. And then he gets hit with a big-ass left uppercut. And then another right hand uh, to a knock Eubank down, and uh, he was out on his feet. Another knockdown occurred late in the fourth round, and, you know, Eubank just didn't have his wits about him. Legs were all over the place. Really can't complain about the stoppage. I know he wanted to move. He wanted to go on. Maybe some rest would have gave him a chance because of, you know, his reputation. He's never been hurt, never been stopped. Um... I don't know, he was in bad shape, so can't really complain about the stoppage. It wasn't I've seen worse stoppages. I, it wasn't it wasn't the the worst stoppage. I think it was appropriate, but considering Eubanks engine, his ability, you know, his toughness and not being stopped before, some referees maybe would have gave him another chance. Maybe uh, a little more time to recover. Eubanks made a couple of mistakes there. In terms of recovery, he got up too quick, didn't take the eight count, but you know it's it's it comes it comes down to experience getting knocked down, and Eubank doesn't have that experience. He, I don't think he's ever been dropped. He's never really been in that position before, and he got up too quick, and he just wasn't ready to really to. And then he didn't have the surviving instinct. His instinct was to just fight. He went back to his old ways, but he this time he wasn't in. 100% condition. He didn't have his wits about him. It was a very good fight. A surprising result. Liam Smith ruined my parlay for the night. All good. There is a rematch clause. Not too sure Eubank is going to activate it. Eubank needs to find his identity back in that ring. I don't think the boxing worked out in his favor. He was getting hit with the right hand. Trying too much to be like Roy. I don't think the the Roy aspect has really worked out. He hasn't really looked great in his fight since he's hooked up with Roy. I think it was a bad a bad choice. Just the chemistry. It's not not in terms of chemistry. It's just it, it's not it's not the right fit. Eubank doesn't fight like Roy. And he's not a boxer. I mean, he can box, but that's not his strength. His strength is to a walk you down type fighter combinations, punches and bunches, that that Chris was more effective and uh, more dangerous when he was coming up in the ranks in the middleweight and super middleweight divisions, but he's, he's changed his identity, and uh, it hasn't worked out in his favor, he hasn't been performing as strong, and tonight, it was a very unexpected result, very disappointing result for Chris Eubank, a lot to think about, man, a lot to think about, even retirement could be a consideration. 33 years old, going on 34 later this year, and uh, coming off a really bad knockout loss here 
against a fighter he was significantly favored to beat. A guy who's been battle tested, a veteran season, but a guy who was coming up in weight and, you know, Chris was favored to win. So devastating loss, devastating result. It's going to be a hard one to swallow for Chris. And uh, congratulations, Liam Smith, man. Just somehow, some way, just continues to be relevant in the junior middleweight, middleweight divisions. Traveling the world, going to people's backyards, you know, losing close decisions to a, to a Russian fighter, uh, fighting the best of the best. I mean, Liam was tested. He was, he's experienced, and his experience, you know, the, the resume, the toughness he brings was just too much for Eubank tonight. So, what a victory, what a win, great result. And a sensational knockout win. Did not expect that result, man. But let me know what y'all think about the fight. Your thoughts on the result. This is Boxing Truth. I'm out.